The vaccine rollout is moving slower than expected across the country, and the same is true here. A vaccine clinic in Salem manned by the National Guard had to close today because they didn't have enough doses. Our Lindsay Nadrich joins us now with the latest, and Lindsay, this is frustrating. Yeah, a lot of people people are eager to get this vaccine and the Salem Salem Health opened a vaccine clinic at the state fairgrounds on Thursday. Since then, they've been able to vaccinate roughly 8000 nurses, firefighters and others who fall into that phase 1A group, but they ran out of doses and had to close today. Take a look. The sign outside the fairgrounds reads closed awaiting vaccines. Our limited supply is temporarily out of stock. Salem Health says they are saving the few hundred doses they have left to reopen tomorrow when they expect to get a delivery of additional vaccines in the afternoon. Members of the National Guard will also be at the clinic starting tomorrow. They were called in by the governor to help reach her goal of vaccinating 12,000 people per day. Well, that's why she called us up is uh, to meet that goal. And so uh, that is that is our anticipation is that we will definitely be able to meet that goal. I know we're talking about fall time frame. That's what's been mentioned. Um, but with the employment of the National Guard, we, we certainly hope to make that uh, before the fall. Salem Health said they were able to vaccinate 410 people per hour at their clinic. It's open to anyone in phase 1A who lives or works in Marion County. So I asked the Oregon Health Authority if there are plans to hold more of these clinics in other parts of the state. For now, they said no. OHA said it will coordinate with provider sites and local public health authorities to coordinate mass vaccination clinics like this when more vaccines become available. Multnomah County Health told me this is something Thing they're talking about. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Natterich, Point Six News. All these months to plan, and we're still going at a snail's pace. All right, Lindsay. The Oregon Health Authority says the state added more than 